Okay, last video we we're talking about networking, why it's important, why you need to have that in-person connection. Now let's go into talking about building an emotional connection with your clientele. It is super important to just go above and beyond building that connection with your clientele for a few reasons. One, if you gain a better understanding of them, you understand their why, what's the driving force behind their product or their service, understand their personality, that can then help you shape how you want to shoot their content, how you want to go about delivering the package to them. Because now you know more about the person. It's going beyond just knowing what the product is and understanding what the product can do and what their service provides. Now you're going into the real core and the ethos of the brand because the ethos of the brand comes from the person behind it. It is those values that they have in themselves that they're going to put into the brand. So once you start understanding that and seeing that, and now you can take that information and put it within your art and what you're going to do with your business, whether it's from the photography standpoint, video standpoint, which is, we'll just call it media and how you're going to now shape the narrative for them. Because once you have an understanding of them, and you build that connection with them, now you're able to tell a better story. With all, everything, every client, every business that I shoot with, I want to tell a story. I want to create a narrative that's going beyond the product or the service. A lot of times, the majority of the times, I try to do almost like a Q&A documentary style, along with whatever content that we're shooting, to get just an insight to who they are, I can learn something, and then their audience can learn something as well, which is then creating that emotional connection. That this is what all this is all that we're talking about is creating that emotional connection. Because once you start cr creating that emotional connection, it goes beyond just the product or the service. Now, instead of customers, you have a community, you have a, a following that believes not only in the product and whatever you're selling or your service, but they believe in you. And once you have somebody who believes in you and, and trusts you, then the product the product sells itself. So that's how I kind of like to approach things. So for me, I always try to get on like a Zoom call. If I can, I'll meet them in person, but I always have like an intro conversation that doesn't even go into so much of what their business is just yet, but I try to get into their personality, understand them, because that can, you start to pick up their idiosyncrasies and little manner, mannerisms, so you're like, okay, let me make sure I, I watch out for this, okay, let me keep this in mind, okay, this person's this way, this is what gets them excited, so forth and so on, and then you can kind of build it out from there, so, and then that's how I shape how I, all of my, just my video, my cinematography, period, I don't care if it's like a five se second clip, a minute clip. I just want to tell like a story, tell a narrative. And that's really what I focus on almost pretty much all the time. Like anything, if it's a brand, if it's a business or if it's like just an individual, it's all about telling the story and, and telling this narrative and being the voice or being a vessel for their voice. And they may not know how to exp express themselves or or feeling uncomfortable, whatever it may be. And then we can provide that. That's why the, the camera is so powerful because here you are, you have an opportunity to be a voice to somebody who might be voiceless or doesn't know how to get their voice out there. So, but all right, I'm, I'm getting long winded, but that's the gist of it. More videos are on the way. Hit the like button if you got value out of this. Let's go.